Welcome back to the archives of the Umbrella Corporation. I'm your host, Albert Wesker, and today we have a real treat for you. A whole fun package of hell on earth. And it's a memory that ironically enough took place in one of our franchise's most debatable worst entries. Operation Raccoon City. For those successful at getting three friends together to form a solid wolf pack, you are treated to a Resident Evil directed by Michael Bay. Explosions everywhere and military chatter every five seconds. For better or worse, this led to some fun moments, and one of them occurred poetically enough right after an explosion. Picture yourself, having just witnessed Leon and Claire's run from the gas tanker a few hundred yards away. You explore, thinking you're about to kill off both of them, when out of nowhere, you see an umbrella chopper with drop pods. You keep your fingers crossed for something easy to deal with, but no such luck as the sharp talon hunters flew out, slicing and dicing. This led to some excellent chaos, and a team betrayed and left for dead. <laughs> left for dead. Even if you're one of those who never liked Resident Evil Operation Raccoon City, you would at least admit that it had plenty on the style and cool factor scales. And these days, when style seems to trump substance, what else can a fan ask for? It's cool. If you prefer survival horror, you have revelations. If you like run and gun giant monsters, you have games like ORC. At least. Until we meet again. <laughs> <laughs> Ha 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 